Uh, she's a three-time state tennis champ at Oregon Episcopal School, but Portland's Rachel Nedro excels at more than just swinging a racket. She is earning a global reputation mm -hmm. as one of the best at a very unique sport. You may have never even heard of this. Coin Local 6 reporter Tim Becker is here with more on Rachel's other athletic talent that's already making her some money. Oh, got it, got it, got it. I'm pretty competitive, actually, yeah. What this girl does... I can do this for, like, it's as long as my feet don't get tired. ...is about focus. I definitely like it a lot. I find it really addictive. So close. Incomprehensible coordination and mind-boggling speed. All Rachel Nedro needs to succeed is a flat-as-a-fritter surface and a handful of slick, non-stick stackable cups. Ready? Let's do it. And the official name is sports stacking, but I call it speed stacking and cup stacking. I mean, my YouTube name is speed stacking girl. How can something so deceptively simple as stacking plastic cups become such a hypersonic, hypnotic hallucination that leaves anyone who sees it slack-jawed? They're obviously amazed, I think, by the quick like aspect of it. They think it's pretty cool how fast my hands are moving, obviously. I could try the flames, I guess. Another woman's like, oh, only, if only I could have hands as fast as you, I could put on my makeup pretty quickly in the morning. I'm like, okay. Yeah, so people kind of just related to whatever they like. I'm on fire. Few in the world are better than Rachel at creating the symmetrical spectacle of plastic and making it vanish again in no time flat. So yeah, the timer is pretty essential, I feel like. Yes! Oh my gosh! With almost 21 million hits on her YouTube channel, Rachel is now turning her talent into cold, hard cash. A lot of people are like, what do you get out of this? I'm like, well, I think it's really fun. And I also can be like, oh, I make money off of YouTube because of this. So that's really nice. It's medal winning, money making ability, enough to make any parent proud. I think they've gotten used to it. At first, it was definitely kind of odd, but I think they, maybe they even enjoy it now. No, probably not, but. Gladly putting up with the click and the clack of her plastic stack all day long. Doesn't matter to her where. I just do it because I really like it. She'll do it in the driveway with big blue cups and back inside with teeny tiny little pink cups. Oops, we go. Practice makes perfect. Anybody can move their hands like quickly, but I mean like to be able to stack cups and have them stay up is a different thing. Six sixty-nine. I think it just clicks with some people. Some people really like it. I'm obviously one of those people. Reporting for you, Tim Becker, Coin Local 6. I was telling Kelly and Bruce, it <laughs> looks like we've sped up video when she's, especially that last right. shot of her yeah. stacking the blue cup. Well, we, have, we actually slowed it down in some cases so you could see what she was doing. We had to slow it down. <laughs> fascinating. Yeah, I mean, that is, was one of the most fascinating stories we've had Seriously. on our air in a long yeah. time. I, I have <laughs> never heard of that before. And I now either. I want to go to her YouTube channel and check it out. Yeah, she's <laughs> so cute, too. That's incredible. All well, right.